everybody, Fletch from All Things Overlanding here. On today's video, we're going to be talking about the NOCO GB40 jump starter. Um, I'm going to kind of walk you through some of the features of it. I'm going to talk to you about some of the different things you can do with this thing. And I'm going to tell you why I got one and, and kind of my intended uses for it. Um, so I think it's going to be a super helpful video. So before we dive in, did want to touch on my featured partners really quick. Um, Overland Addict, everything you could possibly need for overlanding. Click on the link in the description below to go check out his website. Um, Last US Bags. Again, awesome, awesome gear, specifically like tool rolls and just overlanding specific bags. So tons and tons of pockets and options, and they're just awesome. Go click on the link below to check that out. Uh, more at Expo, uh, happening February 2021. And then Northology Adventures. Uh, if you click on the link below, it will take you to her website. There you can sign up for her free overlanding magazine, or you could also check out her events that she does. So without further ado, let's dive into the review of the NOCO GB40. All right, guys, so I did want to show you that it does come with this nice little carrying pouch. Um, you can kind of see how big it is. So if I put my hand next to it, you can see how big it is. It's about, it's about the size of my hand. Um, so it's a fairly good size. It's not teeny tiny. Um, but here's the reason why. There is, it does come with quite a bit of stuff. So the cool thing is, and again, I'm going to put the specs to this thing up on the screen. Let me lay everything out, and then I'll show you what okay, we got. So as you can see, here's everything that comes with the NOCO GB40. This is the main unit here, um, and it will light up and show you, you know, four different bar status bars to show you how low the battery is. Um, you can turn on a 12 volt out here on the end, if I can get it out by myself. It is kind of cool because it's like sort of dustproof and waterproof, all these fittings. Um, but so this is what you would then plug your jumper cables into, which are pretty good quality. They seem to be pretty stout. And you would plug that into that end, and you would hit the power button. You would hit this power button, boom, and it would jump start the vehicle. Um, now you also have on this end, you have a USB out and a USB in. So you charge this thing actually with a micro USB cable, which is also provided, plus a DC USB plug. Um, as I mentioned, it does come with this really big, really nice manual, so it kind of tells you all the different things you can do with it. So another nice sort of side feature is that it does have these little LED lights on the side, so you could use it as like an emergency flashlight, you just hit this light button on it. So again, it's kind of nice that it's got the extra, you know, the features of the flashlight. You can use this thing as a battery pack, basically, to like charge up your phone or, you know, other small devices if you needed to. Um, but the main reason I got it was for the jump pack capability. Um, I recently added a fridge freezer to my vehicle, and so as a result, I, you know, my plans are to mostly run it off of the vehicle battery, and then at night to run it off of my solar battery, but, um, but I just, it makes me feel a little bit better to have an option, right? I do a lot of solo camping and things like that, so I did want to have something that I could use to jumpstart the vehicle if I woke up one morning and I had forgotten to unplug the fridge or it had killed my battery, um, so anyways, so that is the purpose of this thing for me. But again, it's really nice that you could, you know, use it for multiple things. You could use it to charge devices. You can use it for a flashlight. There's, there's, you know, a couple things that you can do with it. So um, the price was also right. So these things go for about $130 to $150 usually on Amazon. When I picked this up, um, it was actually like a lightning deal. So I got it for like $75. Bucks. Um, it's got thousands of reviews, if I recall correctly, and they were all almost five stars. So it seems to be pretty popular. I've also seen a lot of folks on like overlanding, uh, Facebook groups and things like that, talking about this thing and saying that it's just fantastic. So I felt pretty confident in picking this thing up. Um, so again, just kind of wanted to walk you guys through what comes in the bag, give you a quick look at what it is. And again, tell you kind of my uses and why I bought it. So hopefully that's helpful for you guys. Of course, as always, if you have any questions or anything about it, especially as I, you know, start to use it a little bit more, um, definitely post up in the comments below and I'd be happy to answer those. Um, I also have neighbors who tend to have dead batteries all the time. And because of my truck, they're always like, hey, can you come jumpstart my car? And so now with this, I don't have to, you know, start the truck, drive it over through their yard and like do weird, awkward stuff to get the jumper cables. Now I can just grab this thing out of the truck and go over and jumpstart their car. So multiple uses. 
Anyway, so again, I hope that's helpful for you guys. If you aren't already, make sure to click that subscribe button and click the bell to be notified when new videos drop. Um, also, check in the description below for links to Facebook and Instagram and some of my other channels. If you love, if you like that one of those channels, feel free to come over and join the conversation. I'd love to talk to you, and uh, we'll see you on the next video. Thanks, guys. Bye.